Preston Physics, Grade 11, Electricity and Magnetism, Note 13, The Transformer. The transformer is something that changes the amount of voltage in the electricity when we're trying to transfer electricity across a far distance. It's more efficient to increase the voltage a lot when we're sending it and then decreasing it when we get it to its final destination. A lot of the times it's decreased to 120 volts because that's the standard voltage in a North American home. Transformers also only use alternating current. It's just easier for them to work this way. So there's two types of transformers. A step up transformer where it has higher voltage at the end and the way this looks is a few coils at the start and then a whole lot of coils at the end. So we create a bunch of coils on one side of the transformer and not so many on the other. So coil one is less than coil two. And we're looking at the number of windings in these coils. Now a step down transformer has lower voltage at the end. So it's got a whole bunch of coils at the start and then not so many coils at the end. So coil one is gonna be a lot greater than coil two. The voltage needs to become less to go into a house. So we actually have a formula here where we have our secondary and primary voltage. We can now compare the amount of voltage in each side of the transformer with the number of coils and develop a law to actually determine the exact voltage in each of these coils. What we have is the secondary voltage over the primary voltage equals the secondary windings over the primaries or V2 over V1 equals N2 over N1. We can also use current in this case which is I1 over I2. Notice that it's the inverse. Now looking at our example, we know that V1 is 500,000 volts because this is a step down transformer, meaning that our high voltage has got to be first. V2 is then 120, N2 is 1500 windings, so we need to find N1 by rearranging the formula to N2 times V1 over V2. When we substitute our values in, we find that we get 6,250,000 turns which is a lot of turns compared to the second value that we have of 1500. This is an actual good number for the number of turns in this transformer. These are likely answers that you would get in your books. The questions associated with this note are 28 and 29 from your yellow duotangs.